come to try your hand at the $5,000 in gold, I see. You're a man of few words. I respect that. I truly do. I believe you are somewhat acquainted with Miss Stokes. Did you find what you were looking for, stranger? I reckon I did. Do you see a buffalo soldier right in the town? That boy? <laughs> he won't be causing the governor any more problems. I do hope you're planning to attend the Battle Royale. I would very much look forward to beating an adversary of your talent. I just signed up. I guess you're here for one reason, right? You want to enter the Battle Royale. Well, if I was you, I'd get my affairs in order before you enter. Mr. Kelly has been the champion for four years now, and looks as if he's still the one to beat. Though he's definitely got a tougher time on his hands this year. Had that English fella, Swift, in here earlier signing up, and Annie Stokes wants to throw her hat in the ring, too. So, Red, what you gonna do? You want to enter the Battle Royale, too? So many men down south, he had to come up north to find some more. Senor Gabriel Navarro. Challenging him, a man of mystery. Some of you may have heard of all the recent bounty hunting he did on behalf of the town. Ladies and gentlemen, Red. he should be so eager to get himself killed. But rules is the rules, and there's no denying he's quick on the draw. He can't shave, but he sure can shoot. The challenger, Kid Cougar! Red milk, China. 
afraid I've had a little too much to drink. The fine gentleman behind the bar keeps serving a delicious elixir he calls the Red Eye. Red, glad to see you made it through the preliminaries. Tomorrow should prove to be an exciting day. I wouldn't be too cocky, Bounty Hunter. Even a blind squirrel finds a nut from time to time. For our semi-final round, we have a three-time winner and current champion. The sharpest shooter and dresser in the whole territory, Mr. Kelly! The brave soul challenging him is a man who's killed a lot of bad men around here and is looking to kill some more. Red! Due to the sudden absence of Sheriff Bartlett, I'm gonna be stepping in to oversee this, uh, conclusion to the Battle Royale. Now, whereas the two gentlemen before us are clearly the best, I believe a change of the rules is in order. I hereby disqualify Jack Swift and Annie Stokes. The winner of this here round is going to be the winner of the Battle Royale. Red, you're good. I'll give you that. But of course you'd have to be to live through what you did. Still, I'm afraid that we're gonna have to end right here and now. What we should have ended so many years ago. Isn't she a beaut? Yeah! Can I hold it? She's one of a pair. Only two in the whole world. Where's the other one? The other one. The other one. The other one. Mr. Kelly. Please join me at the mansion when you've finally taken care of business. I lost my chance at 5,000 in gold. A small price to pay to avoid shooting you, madam. Uh, Jack Swift, you're just lucky to be alive. Sheriff, are you all right? Oh, I'm all right. Tell me where to find him. His mansion. But it's secured like a fortress. It'll be hard even for a bounty hunter like you. He will not be alone. He ain't the only one who wants the governor. I reckon that their prize money is in that mansion of his. <laughs> <laughs> 